Hello, hello again. And this is going to be a Divine Feminine read. I understand Divine Femmes can be men or women. Okay, guys? So, take what belongs to you. Leave what doesn't. Energy is fluid. Feel free to flip and switch it. I'm going to jump right in because I'm trying to keep this video up under 10 minutes, guys. Okay, guys? So, if you're interested in booking, leaving tips, donations, comments, all that stuff, all the good information is down below in the description box, guys. Okay? On the last shuffle, we're going to see what's going on with the Divine Femme at this time. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. What she needs to know. Or he needs to know. The Divine Feminine Energy. What's going on? Straight off the back. Divine Femme Reminder. Forgiving does not mean that I have to forget. I choose to focus on the lessons and how I can make better decisions moving forward. Okay? So Spirit is reminding you, Divine Feminine, that forgiving does not mean forgetting what they did to you. You can forgive these people, forgive the Divine Master, forgive the karmic, but focus on the lesson, okay? And how to make better decisions moving forward after this, okay? The next card out for you guys is smelling the roses. It says, I focus on the experiences in my journey rather than the destination. So I do feel like Spirit is telling you right now, focus on your 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 journey what's going on right now at the moment then the final outcome okay focus on what you what you need right now or what you're going through right now instead of the outcome stop trying to control the outcome stop and smell the roses what else does divine feminine need to know right now thank you okay so divine feminine alienation popped out for you right now the act of isolation stems from fear of intimacy do not take this behavior personally or try to force anyone to open up. So if Divine Masculine has isolated you, this is because he has fear of intimacy, okay? Um, do not take what's going on personally, guys, right now, okay? And do not try to force this person to open up. Continue to love on yourself. Continue to focus on yourself, okay? The next card we have out is time. I do not wait on others to fulfill my happiness. And I do feel like this is the energy you're in right now, Divine Femme. If you're not, this is the energy you need to be in. You're not waiting on Divine Masculine. You're not waiting on anybody to come make you happy. You're making yourself happy, right? And you're, you're doing that by putting the love into you, performance. It says, I surrender my need to people, please, in order to feel accepted. I am good enough just the way I am. Okay, so Spirit is saying if you're not in that energy, you need to be in that energy. So stop trying to people please everybody. You are good enough just how you are, Divine Fem. And I feel like most of you guys are already in this energy here. And the last card that broke, fell out for you guys was Broken Promise. When you are ready, I know you will fix this. So I feel like this is how you feel towards Divine Masculine. Once he's ready, you know he'll come in and he'll fix the situation. Even though he may be leaving you out in isolation right now or make you feel alienated right now. It has nothing to do with you. It has to do with his own sign. I mean, his own um, fear of intimacy, his own issues here. At the bottom of the deck, we have signs from above. I know that the angels and guides are assisting me. And I feel like this is the energy Divine Femme is in. She knows that the angels and guides have her. Okay? And she's not worried. She's moving forward. She's, she's learning to forgive. She's letting go of things that no longer serve her. And she's moving forward. And she's not waiting on somebody else to make her happy. She's making herself happy. She's done trying to please everybody. And she's done dealing with people and their broken promises. She's allowing God to move in her life. And she's no longer focused on the destination. She's going, she's just allowing the experience. She's going with the flow here. I do feel like she has forgiven those who have hurt her. I don't feel like she's in any negative energy here. I'm the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Clarify reminder. Reminder. Yeah, so I feel like um, Divine Femme is holding back. She's holding on to, to her heart, holding on to her money, holding on to her finances right now. She's just holding on. She's, she's focused on her money. Tell me about this smelling the roses spirit. Yeah, Knight of Swords. So I do feel like there's some type of communication coming in. She's been speaking up her mind. She's been speaking up her mind. She's been speaking her mind. Okay? Or him. Divine Femme is speaking their mind. Okay? And they're holding on to their heart. Tell me about this alienation. Yeah, they're closing out old cycles and they're ready for a new beginning here. And a whole new world. Tell me about this time here for Divine Femme. 
Yeah, and Divine Femme is manifesting their happiness. They're not waiting on anybody else to come in and make them happy. They are manifesting because they have everything they need and they know this. So they're holding back from those who no longer serve them. They're holding back from those who are not giving to their greatest and highest good. And they're manifesting this brand new beginning here. And they're no longer people pleasing. Clarify this performance here for Divine Femme. Clarify, thank you. Yeah, Page of Pentacles. So Divine Femme is not accepting any uh, small offers because it did come in reverse. Okay. Um, yeah, if, if you're not coming with, you know, the the whole nine yards, Divine Femme is not accepting it. She's not accepting any small offers here. She's done with the broken promises. She's done with the games. Tell me about broken promise. Thank you. Yeah, Divine Femme is healed. Okay, and she's moving forward. She's manifesting this new beginning, and she's she's allowing the angels and the spirit guides to assist her and guide her. Clarify signs from above. Clarify signs from above. Thank you. Five of Cups. Okay, she is no longer living in regret with the past. She's moving forward. She's moving towards her 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 new love, an equal give and take, and she's no longer focused on this past. Clarify Five of Cups and signs from above. Yep, she's moving towards her victory and success. No longer living in regret. No longer focused on the things that no longer serve her. If it's not making her happy, if it's not bringing her victory and success, she's not fucking with it. Huh, told you. There she comes. She's loving on herself. Self-love. Whether this is man or woman, self-love. They're loving on themselves. They're giving to themselves. They're finding victory and success with themselves. And they're no longer living in regret or worried about what happened in the past here. So if this resonated with you guys, let me know down in the comments section. Also, if you'd like to book a personal um, or buy any of my products, all that information is below in the description box. So until next time, guys, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. <laughs> Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, TT's babies.